With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Today we will be solving the given question which is an assertion and reasoning question. So our assertion says that the elastic spring force arises due to the net attraction or repulsion between neighboring atoms of the spring when it is elongated and compressed. So let us check is this assertion true. It says that elastic spring force arises due to net attraction or repulsion between neighboring atoms of a spring when it is elongated or compressed which is true whenever an elastic spring is uh, uh, elongated or compressed the neighboring item atoms of the springs also elongates um, so spreads apart creating a big distance between them and as the distance increases or decreases the pressure or the force increases arises whenever it is uh, elongated the tension develops uh, to come back to its original position similarly whenever it is compressed a uh, force develops to go back to its initial position so our assertion can be termed as true so we can write that assertion is true. Now let's move to reasoning. The reasoning says the laws of derived forces such as spring force, friction force are independent of the laws of fundamental forces in nature which is completely false. I'll tell you why. Any law in that has a mechanical or physical force such as spring force or friction force they are completely under the fundamental laws of forces in nature any kind of force are based on the laws of fundamental forces in nature so therefore our reasoning or the reason is false therefore we can conclude that the option C option third here this one, it is true that is assertion is true but reason is false thank you Hope you all understood. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.